Little C's Creation and More Happiness Homemade on YouTube. I'm going to do a little haul for you today. Two separate hauls. One is going to be from BJ's and the other is going to be from Kroger. Where we're eating healthy and somewhat organic. So the first item I've got for you right here is... This is going to all be from the BJ's. And this is the... Brown, with brown rice and garlic. Ingra with brown rice and garlic. Get $90. Now, I don't know how much I paid for all this stuff. So, I think this was close to maybe 8 bucks, Something like that. I can't remember exactly. But anyway, and then I got this three-pack of bone broth. And it has no GMOs. And I like this bone broth, and I use this for cooking as well as sipping. I also needed some meat. We needed some big... We, I needed to go grocery shopping. So, I normally get the chicken from the farmer's market, but this time of year, the farmer's market's not open. So, I have to do what I can do, but I try to get it with no antibiotics whatsoever, cage raised, you know, raised cage free, I mean, all that. I try to get that. And so, this is the chicken thinly sliced breast. And this is chicken wings. It's the same. It's no antibiotics, no anything. And these are the chicken wings. I got a bunch of those. And then over here, I got a bunch of the chicken thighs. Got a bunch of the chicken thighs. I went ahead and decided that I was going to get some bulk items. So I'll have them in stock for when I need them. And then I got me some organic broccoli fur furlets. Frets. I got those, had those before. Those are really good for doing things. And then I went on a splurge and I normally get organic, but I decided to get the Eggos, the whole wheat, whole grain, um, waffles for Alice. So this is everything that I got at BJ's. I can tell you the price later, but it's outside in my purse. And once I unload the other stuff, then I'll bring my purse in and I can tell you what, what I paid for. The items at BJ's. So the BJ's cost $76.41. And I didn't think that was a bad deal. So now I'm going to go and move on to the Kroger. And right now they're in bags. So I'm just going to pull them out, tell you what they are, and I'll tell you the total at the end of that. First off, I got some Old Bay shrimp. I thought that would be good for like a snack or for like, you know, anything. Like if we want to do an appetizer or whatever. And it's Old Bay and it's pretty good. I got some organic carrots. I mean, celery. Sorry, celery. I got some organic lemons. I like to make lemon water. I haven't done it in a while, but I need to get back into the swing of doing lemon water. So, got some of those and any other food prep I need. I decided to splurge and get me some Scrapple. I'm the only one in the family that really eats it. So, I thought that would be good for some lunches with some eggs or something for some protein. I don't know. It's maybe not the best, but it's better than... And I got some Nathan's All Natural Cured Hot Dogs. There's a no random order. Some I got two of, but... And then I got me some russet potatoes to have some time. I got me some... Turkey Uncured Franks. And I also got some chicken tenders just to have. I don't know if you could see that. That's some chicken tenders to have. Okay. And then the next bag. I usually get organic on most of the veggies, but I saw these and thought they looked good. And so, sometimes you got to do what you got to do sometimes when you need a large quantity. So, I got sea salt and cracked black pepper Brussels sprouts. I got two of those. I got some shrimp they had on sale. Peel on D-Vein shrimp. They got me two packs of those. I got my daughter some of these... Tyson Nuggets. They don't have any fillers or hormones or anything like that. So I got her some of those. The dinosaur ones. She's had this before. Really likes them. 
Okay, and then in this bag, I did a splurge, and I don't normally do this, but it has no artificial flavors, no preservatives, and I just went ahead and got it for like a quick meal. I don't always do this because I we like to eat organic, but I got white chicken and pasta and creamy sauce with broccoli, carrots, and corn. I thought that would be something kind of quick to have for like Alice and for us to just to portion out um, and have, so I thought I'd get that. I had a coupon to get some crackers for free, so I got me some of my gluten-free crackers. I mostly have to eat gluten-free. Then I got some low-fat cottage cheese. And here's some more of those hot dogs. I'm going to freeze some and keep some out. We do swim lessons two nights a week, and then on Saturdays she has soccer. So it's a pretty big schedule, and then once a month we go to church. So, it's pretty, pretty big. And then she has, you know, I, she takes her lunch every day. So, I get some Lunchables. Some pizza ones and some cracker ones that are organic. For her to have. And then, in this one, I got some natural lamb. It's a shoulder. But I think I'm going to do it kind of like a steak. Maybe do it like that. I don't know. I'll look for the recipe and see what I can come up with. So I got that. And then over here, I've got some baby spinach because we go through that pretty good. We like to have sautéed spinach, whatnot, with meals. And then I did another. I got me some white wine and garlic mussels. I like them, and that makes a good meal with some veggies. And I also got me some power greens for smoothies. I like to put these in our smoothies because we usually do smoothies and berry mix a lot of times. And then we do like some, we do various things. Sometimes we do with the veggies, sometimes we don't. But I like to have it on hand. That's all of that bag. And then in this bag, I got me some popcorn. I like to have a little bit of popcorn at night sometimes. So I got me some and it's got organic Coconut oil, Himalayan salt, and I've had this before, and if you um, want to try it, it's really good. And you can always add some more butter to it. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. And then, I don't normally eat these, but I got a little purge, and I got me some blue corn chips. And then, I got me another bag of popcorn because Alice likes to also have popcorn. So I got me some more the bag, another bag of popcorn. I got me a little bit of organic Cheetos. We don't normally do these either, but I just got these for Alice to splurge with and stuff. And yeah, I don't think they're gluten free too. So I can have a little bit if I want. Just a little splurge. I got me some juices just to have on hand. They were on a good deal. So I got apple, romaine, these are all organic. So I got apple, romaine, cucumber, spinach, kale, and lemon. Then over here, I got ginger, kale. It is cucumber, celery, romaine, lemon, ginger, lime, kale, and spinach. And then I got me apple, romaine, cucumber, spinach, kale, and lemon again. And then I also found one that was really interesting that I wanted to try, which is Caro Turmeric. And it has carrot, cucumber, orange, grapefruit, lemon, ginger, and turmeric. And then the last but not least, I got some cucumbers, some organic cucumbers, because I like them. Alice likes them. And they're very good for you for all sorts of issues. And I have an um, issue that I'm trying to work on. I have psoriasis and I have eczema and I'm trying to work on that. So this is my big haul. It came to $123.03. So I didn't think I did too bad plus the other haul. So I don't think I did bad. These groceries are going to last a good long while. And I'm very happy and pleased with what I found and the amount I found it. This will last us pretty good. And I just want to say... That state, if you like this video, you like these hauls, please click the like button. 
so you can stay tuned. And I plan on doing more of these. I'm getting ready to start a health regimen, a full-on health regimen. I mean, I'm doing it kind of, but I work out with Beachbody doing that. Um, I also am going to be start starting back up the container system where I'm eating really healthy, um, real, you know, I'm eating gluten-free, um, whole family's getting on board with it. Alice doesn't need to lose weight, but she's going to, you know, can vamp her up some. Michael's going to do it with me. We're getting ready to do this program, um, the, the container system program, where we just measure our portions and container and do all that. We really need to get serious with our weight. So if you'd like me to document that, please put that in the comments below. If you have any questions, comment below. Feel free to say anything you like. Also, thank you very much for watching this video. I really hope that you liked it. I really hope your day is going well. And please hit that notification bell so you can be informed when and so you can be informed when my videos come up and please share the video so it gets out there for the folks. Thank you so much and I hope y'all have a great day. Mwah.